do you remember TikTok ads two years ago? Everybody was making tons of money because it was a new thing. This new thing is the Facebook marketplace. So with the growing popularity of this platform, it's essential for us to know how to list products on this platform. An excellent way to find these winning products is to do product research. After all, if we don't know what products are trending right now, what products are on the wave right now, we're not gonna win at this game. So join me in this video where I have prepared a list of 25 best-selling products for Facebook Marketplace. Let's dive into this. Now, before getting started, I want you to know three things. First of all, the Facebook Marketplace is such a great place to start dropshipping because it has such low fees. Second of all, because it's a relatively new platform, you can only sell on the Facebook Marketplace if you are a US citizen. And third of all, I want you to know that when you're dropshipping on the Facebook Marketplace, you don't have much competition. With that in mind, these are the 25 best-selling products for Facebook Marketplace. So guys, all of the products that I'm gonna talk about in this video can be found by clicking the link Link in the description make sure to check it out because each and every product has their own link and you can find them there but also at the same time make sure to watch the whole video because it will add a lot of value to your business so first category that I'm going to talk about is of course furniture we cannot have a house without furniture right in this category we can sell basically anything ranging from TV wall mounts to rocking chairs office chairs office equipment sofas and number two we have home decoration this is one of the most popular because everybody wants to make their house look beautiful in this category we can sell basically anything that's aesthetic to our house we can start with this black circle mirror, ceramic circular vase, woven basket, Rubik's cube candle, and artificial hanging plant. I have a beginner's tip for you here. In this niche, you can take full advantage of platforms such as Instagram and Pinterest to get really nice images and videos of these products. This will definitely increase the traffic on your store and you can have really nice ads with the pictures and videos that you can find them. At number three, we have print on demand products, AKA POD. The print on demand business model allows us to customize and print products with unique designs. And since these products are pretty unique because we are basically creating them, we are creating a perceived value because you cannot find those anywhere else. For print on demand products, you can sell mugs, magnets, buttons, posters, phone cases, notebooks, keychains, socks, underwear, and so on. In my opinion, print on demand is a niche that will always work. It's evergreen. I know this niche is like 12 years ago and it has always been performing well because you can always find new designs to put on products. At number four, we have children's toys. Undoubtedly, now that I'm a new parent, I know what it means. I know that you would do anything to satisfy your children's needs. So you will buy them anything that they wish. And of course, that is why dropshipping children's products is such a good idea. I have an interesting fact for you here. Children's niche has the biggest AOV out of all of the niches. AOV stands for average order value. And that is because people are spending a lot of money on their children. In this niche, really cool products that we can sell on the Facebook marketplace are the following. This foam ball shooting gun, tricycle, electric car toys, this princess tent right here. I have a daughter and I can imagine that in like two years, she's gonna put me one of these. Toy rocket launcher, this tea party set, this large dartboard, or this toy doctor kit and my pro tip for this category would be for you to classify the products based on age gaps such as one to three years old three to five years old five to seven years old next up we have garden and tools this is another great niche that you can start dropshipping on a Facebook marketplace do you remember during COVID, everybody was locked inside their houses. So doing gardening felt like a pretty cool thing to do. You didn't have anything else to do. And I think that this stuck with a lot of people and now they are actually enjoying it. So here are some best selling items in the gardening niche that you can sell on the Facebook marketplace. This expandable garden hose, this garden dump cart, this harvest basket right here, this shovel, this gardening tool kit, and this glass weeder. Next up, we have sports and outdoor equipment. A lot of people are doing sports and a lot of people are going outdoors, so you're gonna have a market to sell products in these niches. So here we have this LED camping lantern, resistance loop bands, this flashlight, this huge camping tent, this hunting trail camera, scuba diving fins, this full body swimsuit, and these swimming water shoes. Since a lot of people enjoy going outside, you can make a lot of sales just by selling these products to them. Next up, we have seasonal products. We're in Q4 actually, so this is such a good niche to start selling. Now, I want you to know the fact that I'm not only talking about Christmas. I know Christmas is around the corner, but I'm not talking about Christmas. I'm talking about St. Patrick's Day. I'm talking about Valentine's Day, Mother's Day, Father's Day, but the exact 
examples that I'm gonna give you here are related to Christmas and winter, basically. This artificial Christmas wreath, this snow globe lantern, inflatable Santa Claus, because why not? Of course, ugly Christmas sweaters. They should not miss from any Christmas party. Trick or treat tote bags. And this animated Halloween candy bowl. And by the way, when you're selling such products, for example, these ones that are related to Christmas, make sure to go the extra mile and create some discount codes that are related to Christmas, such as Christmas 2023. Apply this discount code to get 10% off your order, something like that. Next up, we have baby supplies. They cannot miss from this list. Just to give you some numbers to crunch on, the baby niche was worth $77 billion, yes, with a B, in 2020. And it's projected to be worth close to $90 billion until 2026. So we can just take full advantage of that and just take a little itty bitty tiny piece of that $88 billion market cap. In this niche, we could do very good in a Facebook marketplace with the following products. Colorful baby bibs, reusable cloth diapers, ergonomic baby carrier. All the mothers need this. Waterproof diaper bag. Feeding chair, without this all of the parents would be lost. Pacifier set, foldable baby stroller, milk warming machine, this is really useful. And this stroller seat pad. Next up we have car accessories. Basically with this niche you're targeting all of the car lovers. Now if it's pretty hard to target a car lover on TikTok or on meta ads, it's really easy to do that on a Facebook marketplace. So these are some best selling items that you can sell on your Facebook marketplace. Car floor mats blind spot mirror, tinted license plate cover, just be careful, this could get you in trouble, this trunk organizer, this steering wheel cover, and this rear door protective pet cover. Next up, we have pet supplies. Now, the pet niche is huge. It only did like 5 billion in sales in 2022. It's a lot less than the kids niche, but it still has a lot of potential. In this niche, we could definitely sell these products. Round dog cushion bed, pet de-shedding brush, cat scratching ball toy, dog bag carrier, pet car seat cover, and this winter dog vest for when it gets cold. And finally, of course, I was not gonna forget about this, electronics. Electronics are performing exceptionally well. It doesn't matter what time of the year it is, you're gonna do some nice sales if you know how to sell electronics. So in this niche, let's name a few products. This Bluetooth smartwatch. Waterproof Bluetooth speaker, LED ring light with stand, wireless keyboard and mouse set, this car door light projector, ring camera doorbell, and this USB cable management organizer. Now, as I told you what products to sell on the Facebook marketplace, there are some products that you should never sell, so listen to this. First of all, we have adult products. Now, this industry is prohibited to market on the Facebook marketplace. This is pretty self-explanatory. Next up, we have weapons and ammunition. You're not allowed to sell something like that. Next up, products that are violating trademarks and copyrights. You wouldn't want to invent a product to own the rights to that product and somebody else making money out of it, so don't do the same thing. Alcohol and tobacco products. We're here to do dropshipping. We're not gonna sell alcohol and tobacco. Medical and healthcare products. Now, now, if you would have caught the COVID wave, then it would have been a good idea to sell masks, for example. They are pretty much medically related. But now that COVID is over, you don't really need to dig in this field. And finally, hazardous materials. And now I have some tips for you that will help you scale your Facebook Marketplace online business. First of all, use high quality product images and product videos. Now, in order for you to understand this, I want you to put yourself in the boots of your customers. And now I hope that you fully understand why it's so important to have nice quality videos and pictures when you're selling a product. Second of all, we don't only need pictures because pictures are not selling the products alone, we only need text. This means that we need a good product description. We live in the era of ChatGPT where you can write an amazing product description in a matter of seconds, so go ahead and do that. Number three, set competitive prices. Now, given the fact that the Facebook marketplace is not that competitive, you should still look at your prices. There will still be people that are gonna compete with you. Number four, remain responsive. It's really important for you, just as it is on a normal store, on a Shopify dropshipping store, to do your customer service correctly and to respond to all of the emails, all of the tickets, all of the phone calls. You should do the same on a Facebook marketplace and treat it like a normal store. Number five, market your products. It's really important for you to show your products to your potential customers, not let them come to you. We could do this in a lot of ways, but three of the most popular are Facebook ads, Facebook promotions, and Facebook buy and sell groups. And of course, finally, we have scaling and automation. You can save tons of time by using an automation tool such as AutoDS. With the help of AutoDS, you can streamline and automate everything that's related to your online store. Number one, we have automatic product imports. 
If you like a product from our supplier list, you just go to it, you click on one button and it will automatically import it to your store. Number two, we have product research. That's a pretty hard thing to do by yourself. This is why we are here. We have an amazing team that's doing 24 seven research just to give all of these winning products to you guys. Number three, we have price and stock monitoring. Now this is pretty tricky because if you do this by yourself, this is gonna take a lot of your time. You always need to keep an eye on the prices and on the stocks of the products of your suppliers. And this is why we also have automatic price optimizations. We're gonna do all of the work for you if something changes. And number five, we have advanced image editor. You can definitely make good use of this when you're creating your product pages. With these fantastic features, you can definitely fast track your road to dropshipping success. Thank you for watching guys. If you wanna dig deep into the Facebook Marketplace subject, we have a lot of videos to cover that. You can start with this beginner's tutorial or this full case study that takes you from zero to 35 sales. Also, you're gonna get a lot more help by subscribing to our channel because this way you're gonna get notified every time we're posting something new. Thanks for watching guys, have an amazing day, bye bye.